Welcome back, Sports Tonight on Channel's Television. We're taking a look at Coach Gennel's Raw provisional list for the 2019 African Cup of Nations. Um, but the good news, yeah, it's the good news. Mikel B is back to the team. Uh, so you guys um, are giving your reactions. Uh, Skito uh, on Twitter says, I feel either a defender alongside Kelechi Yenacho should be dropped or both Kelechi and Paul Onoachu. Uh, mm. Okay. But where is the creativity in the midfield? Uh, so he's saying, where is the creativity in the midfield? Mikel Obi is back. Let's see what he can do. Adams Jesse uh, says, Austin, for me, Ian Church shouldn't have any business in the Super Eagles AFCON provisional list. He has not contributed anything of sort to the squad in a long time, and his form with, with Leicester City is questionable. Uh, that's Adam's opinion, and that's what I want to read. I want you to also tell me what you think about the provisional list for the AFCON that Coach Genero released today. Let's talk about women's football now. It's 24 more days to go to the 2019 FIFA Women's World Cup. Who's been working with us on this journey? Um, it's coming thick and fast. In, in the Abbasi, Umotong was on this show last night, and he says the Super, the super Falcons will not lose sleep over any team just because they think that they are better, that they will go to the World Cup and give their best. Yes, we are rooting for the Super Falcons at that competition. So, uh, 24 more days to go. Let's take a look at the 2019 Waffle Cup. Uh, the Super Falcons, they've been on fire, Cosmos. 5-1 yeah. in their first match against Burkina Faso. They destroyed Nigeria Republic 15-0. 15, 15. And then today they defeated Mali by two goals to nothing. Ah, what a rush. Well, it is a rush. No, 22 they... goals in. Exactly. And, and, and um, uh, it's um, one of the tune-up matches for the World Cup. Um, even if some of the players are not part of the team that will be traveling to Austria for the preparation of the World Cup. But um, I think it's a good one for them to be able to prepare well for the World Cup. Yeah, you could say that uh, the teams that they play are not particularly... Um, uh, a match for Nigeria or a test of preparation for Nigeria. But I think it's a good one, um, the fact that they can then play. Now they're going to be playing against Ghana in the mm. finals. And of course, uh, certainly, um, the Ghanaians want to make sure that um, they, uh, they redeem themselves after <laughs> the terrible African Women Cup of Nations yeah. that they hosted, that mm -hmm. they played where Amali, uh, they only won the game. Yeah, Amali was decent. Yeah, Amali was decent. And uh, we, we said it, uh, we've seen it on the show, my colleague Cecilia and Yemi Adebayo, they said it this morning that that would be the big test for them. And yeah. it's good to see that they didn't crack under pressure. So, so Coach General will actually be looking at ways that he can, you know, make this team give more of those performances where we least expect. Yeah. And then they do just that. So they play final against Ghana. We're monitoring that one. Uh, let's see what the Super Falcons. Uh, can do. We love it so much. Um, more on the 2019 uh, Women's World Cup. Germany, they have unveiled their squad for the competition. The United States of America also have they've unveiled their squad for the competition. So everyone is looking forward to it. Before uh, we wrap up the show, let's take a look at match day 20 fixtures. Uh, the Nigeria Professional Football League is coming fast. So that's the German team for the World Cup mm. uh, right there. Let's take a look at match day 20 Fixtures, yes, in the Nigeria Professional Football League. Niger Tornadoes, they will take on MFM in Group A. Enugu Rangers uh, will play Bendel Insurance. They we're hoping to get back to winning ways. Their form hasn't been good lately. They will take on Bendel Insurance and need to get all the wins they, uh, they must gather uh, because there's two more games after this one. Katsina United, Remo Stars will play in back. Katsina United will play Sunshine Stars. Wiki Torres will go against Quara United, while Rivers United will play Lobby Stars. That's in Group A. In Group B, inform Abia Warriors. They went to Heartland to destroy them, you know, at Okigwe by four goals to two. They will host El Kanemi Warriors that also lost at home. For about three years, El Kanemi Warriors had not lost a home game. Uh, Delta Force went there to, to break that record. Nasarawa United will play Gombe United. You'll be Desert Stars that have already been relegated. We play Kano Pillars, FC Fine, Uba will take on Heartland, go around, we play Plateau United, while Delta Force will hope to continue their good form against Aqua United. Aqua United wins that, then they will be home and dry uh, for this season. Before we go, let me just take more messages on Twitter. Jonathan now says, good to see Samuel Chukweze in that list. 
what is the NHL doing on that list? I don't know. As the <laughs> coach, let's give him time to concentrate and find his form, please. Adams. JC went on to say, the NHL has been a fringe player uh, for his club. Why impose him on the team when it's obvious he can't give up to what the likes of Iwobi, Onyekuru, and Samuel Kalu can give? Let him go and find his missing form first, then we will welcome him back. Mm. Your opinion. So it's okay. Um, you guys can continue talking about uh, that list on Twitter channels, underscore sports, Facebook. Channels I think sports customers passing short before we go. Yes, yeah, certainly. Uh, we're talking about um, that um, Kalechi and Nacho. I feel Kalechi and Nacho should be given a chance, mm. but um, it depends <laughs> on the coach. It depends on the coach. If the coach says he's going to the Nations Cup, no problem. But if he says no, there's no problem. I feel that gets the best of the player, and um, if no any player cannot be able to match up, and the player should um, you know, get another chance mm. at another time. That's what they're saying. Also, that's what the fans are saying. Thank you so much, uh, Cosmos, for, for your time. Thank you so for much for having light. me. And of course, you, wherever you are in the world watching sports tonight, thank you. Keep talking to us, particularly on this Super Eagles provisional list for the 2019 African Cup of Nations. I want to hear from you on Twitter, channels, underscore sports, Facebook, channels, I think sports. That's the show for the team, the ever winning sports team. I'm Austin Okonakwan. In everything you do, remember. Keep talking sports by for now.